The two most commonly used units to represent an angle are degree and radian. In this video, we will learn what is radian. Radian is an angle subtended at the center by an arc that is equal in length to radius of circle. Let me illustrate this with the help of figure. This is a circle with a radius r. Now I take the copy of this radius and place at this point. And now I bend this line on the circumference of the circle. And now let me join these two points to form an angle theta. Here theta is a particular angle where the arc length is equal to the length of radius. This theta has covered the length of one radius, hence the angle theta is one radian. To convert radian into degrees, simply multiply a radian measure by 180 by pi. Similarly, if you want to convert degree into radians, multiply degree measure by pi by 180. Suppose if you want to convert one radian into degree, multiply 1 by 180 by pi. As you want one radian in degree measures, you need to replace pi by 22 by 7. 180 into 7 by 22 is 57.2958 degrees approximately. Therefore, one radian is 57.2958 degrees approximately. Now let's convert degree into radians. For example, let's convert 180 degree into radians. For that, multiply 180 degree by pi by 180. But here, we don't replace pi by 22 by 7 because here we want the answer in pi terms. Always remember, whenever we are converting into radians, the value of pi is never 22 by 7. So 180 get cancels with another 180 and what remains is pi. Therefore, 180 degree is equals to pi radian and vice versa. Till now, we knew that pi is equals to 22 by 7. But now you also know the another value of pi that is 180. But how do you know where to use which values? Like I told you, while converting into radians, pi is never 22 by 7. And also when pi is accompanied by trigonometric functions like sine or cos, pi is never 22 by 7. Because here the pi will be in angle terms. Now when we know that pi radian is 180 degree, Let's derive some other value which will be really useful in trigonometry chapter. 30 degree is pi by 6. Where pi is 180 that is divided by 6 which gives 30. Similarly, 60 degree is pi by 3. 90 degree is pi by 2. 270 degree is 3 pi by 2. And 360 degree is 2 pi. To make this concept more clear, do watch our next videos for example problems. Thank you so much for watching.